milestone tonight in the fight against climate change, and it's happening on the road. For the first time, more than 5% of all cars sold in America are all electric, which is really good news. The bad news is a lot more people want EVs, but they just can't get their hands on one. Our business tech reporter, Scott Budman, shows us why. Here are a couple of things to know about electric vehicles. For one thing, they're red hot. Sales from April to June doubled. They now make up more than 5% of all car sales in the United States. But here's the other thing to know. EVs are hard to find, and that makes them pricey. They're looking in the showroom. They're looking on the lot. EVs or electric vehicles are in high demand these days. Yeah, you see them like almost every every other car <laughs> is EV. They're all over the Bay Area and now for the first time they count for more than 5% of all car sales nationwide, partly to help the planet, partly to avoid paying high gas prices. But most of the gas prices, gas prices are pretty crazy. EVs are making their charge. Everybody feels like there is a fundamental shift that's happening in the industry and consumers who are in the market the next few years are increasingly now interested in fully electric uh, vehicles. But if you're looking to go from gassing up to plugging in, you'll have to be patient. Want a Tesla Model S? You'll have to wait until at least November for delivery maybe until next year. The Kia EV6 is hot too. One local dealer told me they have one left. Another dealer says they're out. The Chevy Bolt also almost sold out. And if you do find an EV, I was told to expect to pay thousands of dollars over the sticker. Car companies say they can't keep up with EV demand, partly because of supply issues, partly because they've been caught by surprise. But every day, more options arrive, like this new EV from Vietnam-based VinFast, starting at about $40,000, due around the end of the year. Good news for all those looking to say goodbye to gas. Initially, probably the gas prices are just really high right now. I think it's just so much easier to not have to pay for gas and just charge it whenever you want. In San Mateo, Scott Budman, NBC, Bay Area News.